I thought I was a good listener. Turns out listening isn't as easy as it looks when it comes to your children. I sometimes get so busy, I don't notice that Tommy's got something he wants to talk about. And even when he does work up to saying what's on his mind, I don't respond very helpfully. Well, I'll go to prison if you don't go to school, so you're going and that's it. Hmm, that was a bit dramatic, wasn't it? Okay, take two. Deep breath, try again. I'm going to try and just listen, then repeat back, and then summarise. Oh, what's up, Tommy? Wow, that's a big sigh. So you're not going to school? Hmm, wow. Okay, so, you've got a maths test tomorrow, and you don't get fractions, and you think you're going to fail the test, and then everyone will know and think you're stupid. So you're not going to school. I know what that's like. It's a horrible feeling. Okay, so this is where I would normally swoop in with solutions. But maybe he already knows what to do. Hmm, so what can we do? Okay, yes, good idea. We'll get the catch-up worksheets from your teacher and then we can practice fractions together later. You'll get fractions as well soon, I promise. Come on then, are you feeling up to going to school now? Of course, it doesn't always go that quickly or smoothly, but you get the drift.